How to build a personal brand. I'm Randy Zuckerberg, and one of the things that I am most passionate about is helping entrepreneurs build their personal brand because there is nothing that will be more helpful to you in business in the long run than building a strong, powerful personal brand. All right, so here are a few tips. First of all, you gotta create content. That is one of the number one things. I actually have a whole other video on content marketing with my incredibly smart friend, Tamara Thompson. So definitely make sure you check out that video after this. But the importance of creating content and regular content, um, the, the second tip, and these two relate, so I'll go in and out of the two, is that you have to double down, pick a medium that resonates with you. So for example, I love audio as a medium. I've been doing a Sirius XM radio show for seven years now. I love doing podcasting. I love audio because I'm a busy mom and I don't always want to put on hair and makeup and, and a pretty outfit and look at I Sometimes I just want to get up and go and audio is great for that. But everyone has their own uh, medium that they feel comfortable with. Some people love the written word. Some people are brilliant photographers. Some of you might love video, getting in front of video cameras like I'm doing right now. So it's really important to understand who you are and not who someone else wants you to be or who you think you have to be. What is the medium that gets you jumping out of bed in the morning excited? Once you choose that, let's go back to tip one, create tons of content over and over. The more content that you can put out, the better train your audience that you have regularly scheduled content that comes out. For example, my radio show comes out every single Wednesday on Sirius XM and my audience has learned that I'm posting about it on Instagram. I live tweet it. I talk about my guests a few days before. The third tip when it comes to building your personal brand is to pick your topics of expertise. And this is where uh, I see that things go off the rails because we all have so many interests and so many different things. We all wear a lot of hats in our lives. And so people start creating content and they start talking about anything and everything. When you create your personal brand, the more unique that you can be and the more deep you can dive in your niche, the more successful your personal brand will be. So I like to encourage people to pick two or three topic areas at most and really make sure that you go deep in those to be a thought leader. Especially if you're podcasting, if you're making videos, the more unique you can be that no one else can copy you or be creating the same content as you, the better you'll be. I actually have tons of content on creating a personal brand. I have a whole course on Udemy where I talk about how to create a personal brand from scratch. So if you're sitting there thinking, I don't have a personal brand, it's too late for me, it's not. Uh, I have tons of short digestible lessons and tips, actionable things for you to do. So go check that out and make sure you subscribe to this channel for more content on business, investing, and women. Click that bell and select all.